We begin this month with April Fool's Day and end it with the Historical Society. It's April in Berwick, and here are the events for the month. Monday, April 1st, is April Fool's Day. No comment. Although I'd like to tell a good joke. Also Monday, the Berwick Walkers take off at 10.30 a.m., as they do each Monday for a ramble around town. And the Berwick Walkers have added a second walking day, Thursdays at 1 p.m. To find out the location of the next walks, email Berwick fal at gmail.com or call 207-619-3519. Learn about Alzheimer's and dementia at the Burke Public Library on Tuesday, April 2nd, 10.30 a.m. with Linda Bresnahan, a volunteer community educator from the main chapter of the Alzheimer's Association. Lunch is provided and registration is required. Call the library at 207 207- 698-5737. This is hosted by Burrick for a Lifetime. On Tuesday, April 2nd, the Sad 60 All District Band Concert will take place at the Noble High School Gymnasium at 7 p.m. Students in grade 4 through 12 will perform. It's free, open to the public, and will be streamed by Burrick Community Media. Wednesday, April 3rd, from 6 to 8 p.m., the Burrick Police Department and the SAD 60 Community Awareness Committee presents Keep Your Family Safe Online. It will be an informative night on digital safety led by Burke Police Department School Resource Officer Milton Fogg. It will be held at the Noble High School Lecture Hall. No registration is required. There will be a link to watch the program online. For more information, see the Burke Police Department's Facebook page at www.facebook.com slash berwickpd. Did you miss the first Learn to Play Chess session at the library last month? Instructor Paul Roberts is offering a second session on Thursday, April 4th at 6 p.m. at the Berwick Public Library. Get there early. Monday, April the 8th is the solar eclipse. While the total eclipse will be visible in northern Maine, here in Berwick we'll see a partial eclipse. Please do not look directly at the sun during the eclipse. Use eye protection. Viewing glasses and eclipse information packets are available at the Burrick Public Library, so you have no excuse. The total solar eclipse visits Maine on April the 8th, beginning at 3.28 p.m., with the final exit of the moon's shadow from the state at 3.35 p.m. On Thursday, April 11th at 4 p.m., Nomination papers are due to the town clerk for town elections held on June the 11th. Two seats are open for the select board members slash assessors slash overseers of the poor. The term is three years. One seat is open on the SAD 60 School District Board of Directors, also a three-year term. Also on June 11th is the state primary voting. Saturday, April the 13th, the Burrick Public Library is closed in observance of Patriots Day. Sunday, April 14th, from 10 a.m. to 1 p.m., it's the last Berwick Winter Farmer's Market of the season at the Town Hall, not to be missed. Monday, April 15th, is Patriot's Day. Monday, April 15th through Friday, April 19th, is Spring Break. At the Berwick Public Library on Tuesday, April the 16th, the Maine Speaks series begins at 6 p.m. The first of three programs is Morning Maine's Dead, Victorian Hair, Jewelry, and Crafts, presented by Elizabeth DeWolf. The program is sponsored by the Maine Humanities Council. Also at the library on Wednesday the 17th at 10.30 a.m., the Center for Wildlife will present Amazing Adaptations. With assistance from live raptor, reptile, and animal ambassadors, They will examine the special tools for surviving the New England seasons. Come back to the library that evening at 6 p.m. for Teas from Around the World, a special tea tasting program presented by Berwick Public Library's own Sarah Gove. Space is limited and registration is required. Please contact the library at 207-698-5737 to sign up. Here are the monthly programs at the Berwick Public Library.
Berwick's town-wide litter cleanup initiative called the Trash Bash is coming up Saturday, April the 20th. The Berwick Recreation Department will be providing litter cleanup kits, which include trash bags, gloves, and visibility vests. Kits will be available at the Town Hall on Tuesday through Thursday, April 16th to the 18th, during regular business hours, and Saturday, April 20th, from 10.30 a.m. to 12.30 p.m. Once you fill a bag, tie it off, and leave it on the side of the road. The Public Works Department will be collecting the bags on Monday the 22nd and Tuesday the 23rd. After cleaning up a road, please text Recreation Director Josh Jones at 207-630-4467 to let him know which roads have been bashed. Saturday, April the 20th at 1 p.m., Community Reads will welcome David W. Moore to discuss his book, Small Town, Big Oil. This is part of the Great Bay Book Discussion Group, supported by the three public libraries in the Sad 60 School District community. Moore's book is about the effort to fight the building of an oil refinery proposed by Aristotle Onassis in the seacoast in 1973. This will be held at Noble High School Library. Monday, April 22nd to Tuesday, April 30th is Passover. On April the 29th, 6.30 p.m., the Berwick Historical Society will host its first member meeting in the Burgess Meeting Room at the Town Hall. The Historical Society is reforming after becoming inactive during the COVID-19 pandemic, not to be missed. Here is a listing of the April meetings at Town Hall. The Berwick Business Directory is now live on the town website. This directory is an incredible resource for finding the service or product you're looking for right here in town. Support local. Check out the site. There is a rave alert system for York County. This is a reverse 911 application that allows citizens to sign up for emergency alerts such as winter storm notices, evacuation notices, flood alerts, bioterrorism, boil water notices, and where to go for a warming or cooling center. Add Berwick as your location to receive Berwick-specific alerts. Go to yorkcountymaine.gov slash stay dash informed. Subscribe to the Berwick Bi-Monthly today. Keep up with all events and meetings in the town of Berwick. The Berwick Bi-Monthly link is on the town of Berwick's homepage www.berwickmain.org. You can subscribe by email to the Berwick by Monthly from that page. The Berwick by Monthly is sponsored by Envision Berwick. I'm Lisa Hustis and happy April Fools.